to need some Seuss art and oi oi oi. I can't even begin to tell you how excited I am. I am off the charts. My head's exploding. <laughs> I wanna, I'm gonna come around the table here, give you an eyeful of what we're gonna be going through uh, for the next couple of weeks. And I've got a couple of really cool ones here we're gonna go through as well. Hold on. Hang on, it's going to be bumpy. <laughs> oh, see, I told you, bumpy, bumpy. Okay, I got you now, I got you, I got you. Okay, what you're seeing here is a whole lot of stamps. Um, each one of these containers has three layers of stamps. There is so much to go through. Um, in the stamp world as well as some wonderful information and um, uh, distressed inks some really nice ones this thing is full it's very heavy uh, there's so much I want to show you in here and this is a treat I'm saving till the very end and it has nothing to do with stamps <laughs> but it's awesome all right, so I'm going to put you back to your safe place. Uh, this is my, uh, <laughs> this is where I live. <laughs> that is where all my alcohol inks and stuff are. So while we're cruising around, this is where my cats live. They're, oh, there's Sissy Doo. She's sleeping. Okay. <laughs> Let me get you back on here. It's a thing. All right. <laughs> Sorry about that. Okay. No, I'm not going to edit it out because that's, yeah. Oh, you're way up there. <laughs> so, I'm still in the cast. We'll be for the next five weeks, but it's all good. So, I'm going to take you on down. Let's get this first unboxing done, okay? All right. I do know what's in each and every box because I had to clean out my car. And I had to do it proper. So, um, I kind of shifted things around. I made sure that all the light types of stamps, because they were well, uh, uh, they were put in, in pans, like this is, this is the 1800s, this is Picasso stuff, this is, all that stuff remains in, in, their, in the order that they were in. I did not mess with the order. Uh, what I'm really excited about are these press boards, because, by gosh, I had them on my Amazon wish list, but I'm not going to do that anymore. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to get out of the way and just show you what I got. Um, uh, this is stuff that is still prepackaged. Uh, this is uh, Chinese character stamps. Beautiful, beautiful. Doesn't look like they've ever been touched. Um, this one, it confuses me because it says the Chinese alphabet. That is not the Chinese alphabet. That is the American alphabet. In what? I don't know. Okay, I'm not even gonna go there. All right, it's cute. <laughs> um, there's a couple of Ranger uh, rollers. Um, this is a, uh, it has never been opened. I don't know how you guys afford to do this because this, this, I, it, I, you know, if I had to buy everything that everything that I'm seeing here, forget about it. I would never be stamping. Um, this is a sketch box lowercase characters. Um, this is a Imaginations rubber stamps. It's got 28 stamps in there. Um, let's take a look at it. Has it ever been? Nope, that's no, never been opened. Um, Oh, I love this. I have another one the Acte. See, these things come right off, right? So you can put other ones on there. Um, this says, I can't, uh, don't ask me. Uh, celebrations. Um, even things like this are like, like $3 a piece. How do you guys afford this stuff? Uh, <laughs> Diva Goddess. Um, I have lots of these beautiful blocks. They are gorgeous absolutely gorgeous this one is a V that's an S 
the, I don't know what that is. The U, <laughs> if they go alphabetical, it should, shouldn't be too bad. Um, a small version, and you can see right uh, right there on the side what, what that one is. It's got lots of fun stuff on there. Um, this one's gorgeous. Again, some more letters. I mean, I think I've got the whole alphabet with, um, yeah, this one is A, B, C, D, E. She was clever. She marked everything. And um, they all have this most gorgeous background. Uh, this one is W, X, Y, Z. Again, beautiful. This one's H-I-J-K, <laughs> and uh, this one is the biggest of them all. Um, it's gorgeous. Uh, she has her initials on it, so I'm guessing, or P-K comes up a lot, so my best guess is that she created these herself, because she. I have a bunch that, that it's clear that she made them, and they're beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Uh, Oh, OPQR on this one. And again, these are gorgeous. I can't wait to see what they look like all inked up. I'm building a tower here. KLMN. <laughs> so I've got the full alphabet in these gorgeous blocks. That's just beautiful. Uh, Karma Sutra. Say no more. <laughs> Family friendly show here. Uh, this again is not open. These are, it looks to be alphabet and numbers and beautiful beautiful letterings just gorgeous beautiful, beautiful. Uh, again this one is not open and that's pretty much I put the stuff that uh, hadn't been opened in here or couldn't categorize it again we have uh, some really cool uh, lettering kind of Celtic looking uh, this is another stamp and it has a velcro um, attachment to it so I'm guessing what a great tool, you know, if you have these little pieces, you just cut your little Velcro out, and there you have your little stamp thing and on the acrylic. Um, uh, this, it's gorgeous. It looks like a stained glass window with a star at, on it. Um, here's another one. Uh, beautiful flower. Oh, this is a Chinese lettering. I'm going to have to figure out what, what it says eventually, and I will. I, every one of these is so precious to me. <laughs> um, this looks like uh, a snowy scape. Like a snowy scape stamp. And maybe it'll say up here. Clear, clings, clean, compact. Nope, doesn't tell me what it is. <laughs> That's okay. Uh, this one is, is hearts. Lots and lots and lots and lots of hearts. It's so pretty. Now this is $10.98. Now think about this, folks. You looked at all those stamps there just a minute ago. And um, some of these alphabet ones that have prices on them are $16, dollars $18, $20. I would never be able to afford to do this. Now this says PK again, so I'm wondering if those are her uh, her initials. Initials. Uh, this is a, a magnetic stamp alphabet set, and this is a, an expressive magnetic set, which is so cool. Live, inspire, holidays, love, all that good stuff. Um, this is. Uh, this is, I'm, gear, I'm, I'm guessing she might have made this, maybe not. Rubber Art Brad Designs, I'm not sure. It's, it's got a code on the back, I don't know. It's still in the package, but I, rubberart.com, I don't know. Uh, lots of cool stuff, I mean, lots and lots of cool stuff. And this is, this is just the tip of the, we haven't even tipped the iceberg yet, guys. We're just walking on it warm. Uh, this has Velcro on it. It's really cool. Uh, I'm sure you can see that. Isn't that cool? So, I'm, what I'm guessing is she used Velcro. Um, oh, look at these. These are so cute.
this is this is just this we haven't even no gone we, we haven't even gone there um, in, into what what is all this that is art molds ah there's a mold I can use this for epoxy resin look at that or pop it out all right so let me get all this stuff back in here real quick I'm gonna pause you and we'll see you for the next one hey guys welcome back this is Denise from Seuss Art and we're gonna keep going on this this is a small box so it should be really fast to go through um, again we're looking at stamps I don't know what this is let's open it up oh look at this I'm not sure but oh I guess oh these are the stamps and so you put them on the wooden blocks I see oh how cool and then this is how you would put them together that is very cool oh my goodness it's like a build a baby build a baby I love it building babies uh, these are some uh, clear jelly jelly stamps. Um, this is a Tuscan garden. It's, it's not opened. Oh, it's beautiful. Rustic Splendor. It's got some gorgeous stamps. It also has a little ink pad there. Scissors for cutting rubber, which is awesome. And um, I have a, a bunch of these beautiful wheels. Look at this stuff. This is a uh, Page headers, borders, backgrounds, great for scrapbooks. This is the travel series. So it has a, a whole bunch of, uh, I gotta figure out my camera here. Here we go. Bunch of travel stuff. Oh, there's, there's a list of all the goodies. Oh, glare, glare, no. Oh, oh, I suck at this. There we go. No glare. <laughs> um, this one is uh, looks like it would do great stucco work and stuffs. Uh, this is very leafy, lots of leaves, leaves, flowers. Oh, that's gorgeous! That is gorgeous. Oh my gosh, I I I could uh, my head's on fire of all the things I'm gonna do with these. Oh, look at that! You know, I could even use these. They're so clean. Um, on pastry dough. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. I wouldn't though. I want them for my ink. And uh, for all any of you thinking after seeing all this stuff, oh, she's going to sell any of that? No. This is, uh, to me, this is my retirement. This is a way to have joy and um, be creative uh, for the rest of my life. And it was, a, it was worth it every moment. <laughs> okay. uh, this one, this one's going to blow your mind. It blew my mind. It's very heavy. And for those of you that stamp, you probably know a lot more about this than I do, but this one here blows my mind because, and this is why I know I could never be a stamper. Not ever. Um, I mean, I couldn't afford to have what I have today. Um, when I look at, you know, this little thing for almost four bucks, this piece for four twenty-five. Anyway, so this, this, in its entirety, is filled with, and this is like the Illuminati, <laughs> the Illuminati for two dollars. Um, just the most gorgeous. Uh, stamps um, just just all the way to the bottom and and um, oh, what is that what is the daughter of East small um, I don't know I'll have to stamp it out to see what it is this is Chinese lettering actually I think I was Japanese lettering um, there's some some really gorgeous uh, sheets you could literally build like a, a wallpaper for a dollhouse i think mean, freaking great look at that wouldn't that look cool on a journal or a card 
Um, oh, look at this beautiful leaf. That is gorgeous. I don't know if you can try to get it so you can see it. I'm really bad at this. There we go. That's better. Um, and a lot of, uh, a lot of her stuff, she was very clever. She, um, kept them in CDs, and I had seen that on a video I was watching just yesterday. And, uh, so, you know, CD cases are really inexpensive to buy, so I'm going to take and go through all of this stuff and categorize it and put it there. Uh, where you saw the boxes at the beginning of this video is where I'm getting, uh, uh, like those those shells that you find in um, in a restaurant, the stainless steel shells. I'm gonna get those at Sam's and have this all categorized and packed up. They're really nice. There was one thing in here that I never looked at. Again, lots and lots and lots of these. Um, just amazing. I mean, she may have made these. I don't know. I don't. She has letters and numbers and there's prices on a ton of these. It just blows my mind. I don't know how you guys afford to, to do this crap. I mean, unless you like share seven dollars for that. Wow, I mean, I don't know how you guys do this. This is in a special bag, so it's probably special. Come on, $3.25. Look at the size of this bucket and this little piece. This is crazy. Six. All right, I'm going to stop looking at prices because it's just warp. Warp in my head. Okay. Some beautiful stuff. Look at the wallpaper you could do with that. Oh, gorgeous. Mind is blown. Lots of little pieces in here. Oh. You know, that almost looks like a toad. I could send that to Trump. Oh. Wow. Wow. All right. All right, let's see how far are we. Ooh, I think we can do one more quickie. Let's, <laughs> let's have a quickie. I need that in a nice one. Be right back. has some again some stuff that's never been opened um this is um stampers anonymous collection it's got some really pretty stuff on there really pretty stuff uh a locking caddy for little things which is great because i have lots of little things from the the other stuff that frank gave me from his mom um this is impression me stamped and again, this, this has never been opened. Come on, guys. You, you spend that much. I could never afford this stuff. It would take me, uh, I'm 58. I would never have a lifetime enough to have all this stuff. Uh, this is, uh, again, Impression Me, the Aboriginal design. Um, this is Beads B. Oh, this one I love so much. I'm going to be using this for like my, my three-dimensional epoxy resin art. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'll stamp it down and then I'll paint it. Woot. Woot, woot. Oh, another roller. That needs to go in the roller bin. Pretty, isn't it? Look at this. This one has some really funky designs. Uh, this is... This again has never been opened. It also has ink in it. It's... um. By played Plady, um, and Gr by Ann Griffin, foam mount stamp set antique alphabet. Ooh, that's nice. And these are instructions on how to 
use all that stuff, so I saved those. This is really cool. <laughs> totally unrelated, but you guys, can you see this little guy in one of my 3D epoxy resins going down? And then the fish is like over here, and the coral is over there. All right, let, let's put them all in action. There we go. And then uh, this guy here. Oh, I don't know what that looks like. I'll let y'all think about that for a second. Um, <laughs> boo, and then lights, and oh my gosh, that's gonna be fun. Uh, this I found extremely fast, extremely interesting because you know what? It seals pretty darn tight, so I could put acrylic paint in this and work with it. This is this is really cool. <laughs> um, I want to like try to find the year this was made because it's so awesome. Couldn't have been. It's got a website, so she stamps, but and I have all these stamps. I have all of them. I'll show you that um, as we do all the unboxings. I've got all these stamps. I've got all these stamps. Um, and the squiggly line here, just that little tiny stamp, that's like four bucks. Who does this stuff? But I will now. I'm so, I'm so blessed. Oh, and I've got all these guys. Oh my gosh. I don't know. That's crazy. Uh, so this is a whole lot of paperwork, I guess, in this box. Um, oh, and uh, um, some clear stamps and accessories. Uh, this looks to be... Um, Oh wow, really pretty. Buddha ish. Oh, the tree of life, honor, peace, all sorts of good stuff on that one. Um, again, we have another impression here. This is the dolls. Um, cherry pie. And it looks like an ocean, guys. Ocean stamp. Another impression me. Uh, Dolls G. Lots of Aboriginal stuffies. Let me get this stuff out of the way here. Stay. Um, another doll set, but the stamps are missing. That's fine. I think they're in the other thingy. Uh, unmounted. These, again, these are all stamps. Um, Petrograph Angels, oh, how cool is that? Uh, another un un unopened impression me's buttons and beads. Really nice. Uh, redesign, I know where these are. These are already on blocks, I got them packed away. <laughs> um, some more of the clear. This is a stylus tip mounting mat. Ooh, now I know what that stylus tip is for from the first unboxing. Look at that, guys. It all comes together. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Fishies. Um, this is the mixed solids A. Again, some beautiful Aboriginal. Uh, this looks more Native American. Mixed solids, it's called. It's gorgeous stuff. And um, the, this is a glimpse of some of the... Um, oh, this is probably where one of that goes to. Of some of the stamps uh, that, that I was given. Uh, there's a dog. I mean, th this is an animal set, I think. This was kind of a mixed media. Everything else pretty much had a purpose and a place. Um, Italy, this has some Italian flavor to it, um, Believe, <laughs> and a cow, I love the cow, he's so cute, alright, alright guys, so I'm not going to bore you with my packing up, but that's it for today's unpacking, and we've got lots of unpacking to do, and I'm so glad you're here with me, because if you recognize something, um, 
let me know. Uh, I really want to know. I mean, you know, I have a lot of information to go through from her um, notes and her stuff. And she also, um, she also had books on stamping and journal making and card making and stuff. And so I have a whole box full of books, which is great. Um, so I'm so happy and I'm so tired. <laughs> I love you guys. Ciao, Bella.